No, it is real, honest, and true. That's not a line out of a romance novel, but part of a letter from a 50-year-old man to his 16-year-old student. Now 20, Brittany Tarabor of Middletown was that student. The teacher, Stephen Lloyd, was also her advisor, crew coach, and dorm supervisor at the prestigious Petty School in Heightstown. He sat there and held my hand and talked about how he always had a personality crush on me and that if we were born in the same era, we'd be together. Brittany's family just won a lawsuit against Petty after a jury found the school failed to stop the harassment. While it was never sexual in nature, Brittany says her teacher would often hold her hand, invite her to private dinners, and send her 1,600 emails. I was creeped out by it, but I was always told that it was fine, and I thought that maybe I was wrong. Maybe, oh, well, maybe this is what everyone's like. You don't have to have an invitation for sex or a vulgar sexual comment or even a sexual touching in order for some conduct to be offensive and hostile and to constitute sexual harassment. Brittany, now a junior at the University of Delaware, had refused to settle out of court. With law school in her future, she hopes her legal victory will send a message to other young women. Yes, you should respect your elders and... You should also fight for what you believe in. And if you believe that something that's going on is wrong, talk to someone about it. See live traffic cameras from around the tri-state area. Go to channel 612 and select traffic on News 12 Interactive. Only on cable vision, not on phone company TV or anywhere else.